Is your iPhone showing the charging icon but the battery percentage isn't going up? Don't worry, this is a common issue and in most cases it can be fixed with a few simple steps. Whether you're using an older iPhone or the latest model, try these proven solutions to get your battery back to normal. Let's start by opening the settings app on your iPhone. Just scroll down and tap on battery. Then select battery health and charging. Here look for the option named optimize battery charging. This feature is designed to reduce battery aging by learning your charging habits. However, it can sometimes slow down charging when your iPhone thinks you don't need a full battery right away. If it's already turned on, try turning it off. Choose turn off until tomorrow, which means the feature will be disabled temporarily just for the rest of the day. After that, optimized battery charging will automatically turn back on the next day. Faulty charging accessories are a common reason for this issue. Carefully inspect your charging cable and power adapter for any signs of damage. If you're unsure, try using a different cable and adapter, ideally an official Apple charger or certified one, and see if the battery percentage starts increasing. Avoid using cheap or uncertified accessories as they may cause slow or inconsistent charging. Over time, dust, lint, or dirt can build up inside your iPhone's charging port, blocking the connection between your phone and the cable. I recommend to use a soft, dry brush like a small toothbrush to gently clean the port. Do not insert metal objects and avoid using liquid cleaners. A clean port can often make a big difference in how well your iPhone charges. Lastly, try force restarting your iPhone. Force restarting your iPhone won't delete your photos or datas. It's a simple reboot that fixes temporary glitches. To do a force restart. Quickly press and release the volume up button, then volume down button. Finally press and hold the power button until the Apple logo appears on the screen. Once you see the Apple logo, release the power button and let your iPhone restart. Make sure to do this quickly. If you go too slowly, Siri might activate instead. So that's it, a quick and easy force restart for your iPhone. This process helps fix any minor software glitches or bugs that might have been causing problems. If your iPhone still won't charge properly after all these steps, there might be a deeper hardware issue. In that case, it's best to visit an Apple store or contact Apple support for professional help. And that's it! If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell so you never miss out on more tips and tricks. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.